It's a DUI Choose Your Own Adventure Part 27. Now, I've had a couple of drinks tonight. I don't really feel intoxicated, and I think I'm below the legal limit. But when the cop asked me, How much have you had to drink tonight? I told him, I had a couple drinks a few hours ago, but totally good to drive. Which was the truth, but he didn't believe me. Just so I know that you're good to drive, would you mind stepping out for a field sobriety test? To which I said, Field sobriety test? Sure, I'll give it a shot, why not? So here I am on the side of the road doing everything he asked. I hit my foot up there. He shone that light in my eyes. I looked around, think I did great. That's not a test I can pass. That's just giving him more evidence. So eventually he asked me, Would you mind performing a portable breath test? To which I agreed. So now I blow in the portable breath test. Let's assume you blow below the 0.08 limit. Good for you, right? Not really. You see, if the cop has asked me out of my car, perform field sobriety, he already believes I'm intoxicated and his plan is to arrest me. So when I blow below the legal limit but alcohol in my system, he assumes that I'm intoxicated but because of something else other than alcohol. So he's gonna start asking, What kind of drugs you been taking tonight? Drugs? Of course not. So I tell him emphatically, No, I don't do drugs. No drugs in my system whatsoever. So now you gotta choose. Do you think he believes me when I tell him no drugs? If you think he does, because I did tell him about the alcohol, go to part 35. Or you think he doesn't believe me? No, no, no. I'm probably lying about the drugs because anybody who takes drugs is gonna lie about it. Go to part 34.